Hey school, imagine if you have to start a new life, totally independent, and being 14796 kilometers away from home. My name is Admin, and I just arrived in Toronto from Malaysia, the country between Thailand and Singapore, on September 1, 2010. Frost Street was not due to start in four days, but I had so much to do, so much to understand about this amazing city, and even more to understand about myself. Being away from home, I lost all sense of identity, missing all I knew, my friends, my family. Anyway, being accepted into engineering at U of T was a big deal for me. Heck, it meant the world to me. Yet, the people I knew were friends from Malaysia, who knew nothing about ice hockey and that Canada was not part of America. I knew nobody from Toronto and I was afraid. I was afraid I would embarrass myself, my funny accent, which I still have and I was afraid nobody wanted to talk to me. During Frost Week, I was encouraged by my leaders to dye myself purple, and I did. What I knew was that it would stain my washroom and that it would make me look like Barney. What I didn't know was that it gave me a renewed sense of confidence and a new identity. When I was walking around downtown, people who had no idea I was an international student came up to me and asked, are you an engineer at U of T? Wow, that reaction? from strangers was insane. It made me feel so confident knowing that I am part of an awesome group of people who had their identities cemented in public. From that moment on, I knew that I was not a loser and I belonged somewhere. I'm part of U of T and more importantly, I'm part of school. So leaders, Frosh, if you ever feel like you don't belong, you do.